Hi everybody, I'm Mike from Arcan Trailer. Today I'm going to show you a new floor plan from Arpod uh, for 2020. They're calling this line the uh, Arpod 2.0s, so they are a little bit bigger in size. Uh, this is the 195 model. So first thing you'll notice right away is it, it is a little bit wider uh, than in ages past. So the traditional Arpods are six and a half foot wide, whereas this one is uh, seven foot wide. You'll notice they still do the um, eight foot axle with the big tires, part of the Hood River Edition, the 15 inch extreme off-road tires with the uh, torsion axle. Um, so a couple changes with Arpod this year. They basically went from having a bunch of options and making a bunch of things standards, um, just to make it a little bit easier for the consumer when they're trying to decide what they want or don't want and uh, keep the prices streamlined as well. So a big change for Arpod last year was uh, changing the way that they did the walls. And when I say that is it is still the fiberglass laminated exterior, but it's now laminated with a piece of Asdel versus the Luon wood. Um, Asdel is kind of a manufactured, almost plastic kind of material. Um, it's lighter weight, it reflects sound a lot better, um, it has increased R values, but the most important thing is, is it's impervious to water. So if you do happen to get a leak for whatever reason, um, it won't cause such, a, such damage to your unit because uh, there, there's no wood to swell up in the wall anymore and, and it won't bubble out the same way. So really cool upgrade um, that they started rolling out last year. So we'll start on this guy. Like I said, you'll notice it's quite a bit bigger. Um, still has the power tongue jack up front with the propane quick connect. This one has the outside removable kitchen. And when I say removable, it just unclicks inside and comes right out. So if you don't care for it, or it's not really a feature that you're gonna use on a particular trip, you can just take it out and use that storage space. It still has the water spray port as well. You've got a 14 foot hose right here. So you have outside water. And then uh, with the 2.0s, they went to the bigger, more traditional kind of size awning. So nice eight foot awning. Um, you don't have to worry about any bars or anything to, to keep it in place like the old R-Pods had. And it's got the LED light strip throughout the whole roll, so you can see it's nice and bright in front of the trailer. You'll notice it still has black tank flush, just like they've had for the past few years. Friction hinge door, double entry step. Let's go inside and check it out. All right, welcome. So this is kind of like the bigger brother to the 179 floor plan. So this has got the rear kitchen. Um, but you'll notice right away that the roof line is very much straighter than it is in kind of the, the 1.0 R-Pods. So nice big kitchen. You got the big six cubic foot two-way refrigerator. Okay, that's new for R-Pod. They went to a bigger sink, stainless steel with the cover. Nice counter space. You got the glass cover on your stove top for even more. A couple cabinets above. Convection microwave, same one they've had for a little while. A little bit of accent lighting. New feature as well this year is the central vac. So you can plug that in and have a vacuum cleaner or you can use this kick flip and just sweep into that. Really cool feature. And then there's also some doggy uh, pet bowls that it comes with. Coat rack, monitor panel and controls, and then your solar charge controller. So this is now wired for solar. Um, you just have to put the panel on. Pretty cool. You can also order the panel from the factory. Uh, big pantry with removable shelves and then the U-shaped dinette. So this does have a freestanding table. It's in kind of the transport position right now, but you can take that out, move it around, take it outside with you, whatever you want to do. The legs are metal, so it'll stand up to the elements and uh, more storage. Can never have too much. And then your washroom. So this is one of the biggest changes for our pod in the past few years, starting to develop the dry bath. So your shower, vanity, and your toilet are all separate. Nice tub surround goes right to the roof, skylight, and of course the pocket door. So anything to save room in a small trailer like this. So this is just tucked away in the wall nicely. Nothing is opening or getting in the way or impacting the dinette. Master bedroom, again, another huge change for our pod. So now that we have a little bit of extra width, we can do a walk around queen bed with the window up front, really sharp look. A couple cabinets, some nice backlighting, TVs in here as well. It is a 12 volt TV, they changed that this year, so uh, you can run it off of your battery. It's got the Furion Bluetooth deck that they've been using for the past few years. Same air conditioner, 13,500 BTU. Otherwise, that about does it. I'm Mike from Arcan Trailer. This is the R-Pod 195. I'll catch you next time. Hi everybody, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. This way you can stay on top of all our trailer demos, our walkthroughs, upcoming promotions here at Arcan Trailer. I'm Mike, I'll catch you next time.